want to talk about how difficult it is to make a video during the pandemic. <clears throat> First of all, Shea Carter and I figured out what the collective dance moves would be for Shoshana, Anika, and I and made how-to videos. Then I got a pop-up green screen I shot my stuff in front of, sanitized that, and sent it to the other girls with the how-to videos so that they could do their video and moves in front of the green screen. All of that was sent to our editor to make it appear as if we were actually together. I was sending all of my friends who were performers texts, hey, you know, I'm doing a song about female empowerment. We're featuring all of the Democratic women who are running for office in 2020. Do you wanna be involved? And literally almost everybody said yes. I won't forget the people who said no. You're on my list. <laughs> but then each girl did their own video with some extra flair of expectations of women. So some women were cooking, some women were dyeing their hair. My favorite is Brittany Snow dyeing her hair throughout the whole video. It's hilarious. It's some women are doing their makeup. It's sort of like these expectations of women. A lot of them are doing these. And then a few people dressed up as Rosie the Riveter, Natalie Z had like this like Greta Garbo uh, man suit on. So all of these women did their own sort of versions of the video and they sang specific lines and Shay and I figured out which lines we were having them sing, which was, oh my God. My cousin Addie worked on collecting and tracking all of the women running for national office in 2020. And the longer it took us to do this, we were losing <laughs> women. So like we had to track these women, make sure that we had footage of them and their photos. And then we also were gathering footage of 100 years of women's history because we're also celebrating women's suffrage on this video. And I also might add that all women did not get the right to vote until 1965. But in this video, we're tracking women in history from suffragists to women in the workplace, to birth control movement, women's rights movement, and ERA, and on and on and on and on. This video really is about women getting it done and fighting for what they believe in on every level, whether that's protesting or whether that's actually running for office. Jasmine, our editor, is our MVP. Once everything was edited, it was sent to Claire Chin, who animated over it, bought her baby girl an airplane and her son a doll, and diploma. It all came together, but it was a doozy. This project would not have been possible without all of the women involved. I have much gratitude to our creative team, Jasmine, Ariel, Claire, Addie, and Hannah, and Shay for helping me get this shit together.